It's kind of funny because I think they thought uh, it was an actor. I am not an actor. Have you seen this ad here on Channel 7 for St. Luke's Children's Hospital? It features pediatric nurse Joe Rontillo and his amazing dance moves. Nurse Joe is not a real actor, as he said. He's the real deal. And he's been taking care of little patients at St. Luke's for years now and adored by the patients and by their families. He's good. Maggie O'Meara tells us all about this hero and how his dancing brings so much light and love to these little warriors. Here now is tonight's Seven's Hero. I've been here almost 16 years. You can see that nurse Joe Ronquillo loves his job. He prides himself on taking the best care of his little patients. Patients like baby Naomi, who's battling a brain tumor. It means everything. I think working with our oncology patients is very meaningful for me because I know that they're chronically ill children that have to stay here and oftentimes it's days or weeks or even longer. I think it's a, an amazing thing to be a part of that. Nurse Joe has an incredible story. Before he was born, his parents immigrated to Idaho from El Salvador. My parents brought my older brother and my older sister from El Salvador, then I was born here with my little sister. So I was born here, that's right, first generation. But he isn't the only one in his family to go into the medical field or to work at St. Luke's Hospital. My whole family works here. My sister Lavinia and Sabrina are both respiratory therapists and my brother Marvin's a nurse downstairs in the NICU. His parents are so proud. And Joe is also well known for something else here at St. Luke's. <laughs> is dancing. The best carrot and the best moves. If he's your nurse. There's a good opportunity that I might be dancing for you. And so it's a win-win. I call it giving extra flavor. So it's your last day. How long were you here? Forever, huh? Yeah? 27 days. 27 days? Oh my gosh, the whole month. This is Maverick Getchy. Today is a big day for this six-year-old boy. Great. Let's listen to your tummy. I heard a couple ribbits in there. Did you have frog's legs for breakfast? That's my best joke. Did you know that? Maverick told us why he's had such a long stay. I was like in tears of my belly hurting. And then my appendix exploded. He had some complications, but Nurse Joe made his days at the hospital a lot more fun. Your mom says you like to dance too. Is that true? Fantastic. And I love to dance also. All right, give it a go. Oh wow, look at that, that's fantastic. Look at that, that's, free, that's called freestyle. A dancing nurse, have you ever seen that before? No. So what does he do when he comes in? Dance, a nurse that dances all the time. Did you have a dance contest? He did a robot, like I did my hair flip and like an awesome move. Well, those were my two moves. The dark side. Nurse Joe is also always game for a lightsaber battle. I am a Jedi, like my father before me. Joe is something of a social media star. You may just spot a touching post or two of him dancing with his patients on Facebook. <laughs> He's well loved in the childhood cancer community. Everyone's hoping Nurse Joe is on their ship. One parent will film a little video and then it'll just spread around. The greatest joy for me is dancing for them here at the hospital. It's not just treating the disease, it's also treating the entire patient. So I think those are the moments that I cherish the most. For Joe, bringing his young patients a smile during their worst times is everything. It's the best feeling in the world. Then I'll go back. Nurse Joe Ronquillo. And then we'll go. Seven's hero. Holy cow. I hear he's good at that flossing thing too. And I know he knows how to do that. Joe just finished nurse practitioner school. He says his patients inspired him to do that. He's not sure what the future holds, but he says even as an NP, he's going to keep on dancing and taking the very best care of the children that he knows how. You keep going, Joe.